Hello everyone, it's a great pleasure to be with you tonight from the Granite City here in the northeast of Scotland, Aberdeen. My name is Derek Ray and my commentary partner on this occasion is Stuart Robson. And we've got Champions League semi-final first leg action coming right up for you. It is Aberdeen against Atletico Madrid. Well, what a moment for both these teams. Just one step away from the final. But it's the visitors and their fans that are expecting to get through to the big day. But this is by no means an easy game for them, as their host can be really dangerous if they play at their best. A creative look about this. Ramirez on to Hayes and a timely intervention and this is the starting lineup for Atletico Jan Oblak stands between the posts Jose Maria Jimenez plays with Stefan Savic in central defence Koke starts alongside Jeffrey Kondogbia in central midfield and the strike partnership Antoine Griezmann plays with Koke off the post and back in play. Thomas Lemar. And a goal! The opening statement in this semi final. How important can that prove to be? Well, here we can see it again. He's shown outstanding vision to find the perfect cutback, while the movement in the box is equal to it. It's such good timing. What a goal! The match has restarted. 1 0 here. Luis Suarez. Scott Brown. Just knocking it around, looking to carve out a chance. Well, that's a really good authoritative tackle. Throw in here. Kondogbia. Marcos Llorente. And here's Lamar. Koke. Lamar. Now Griezmann. Fine ball from Antoine Griezmann. And cleared away. Suarez, well, far from textbook defending, and I must say that was a very promising attack. The alarm bells were sounding. Suarez. Well, goal kick, just as it was looking promising. Won it back. Suarez. And now Lamar. Well, he knew he had to get to the ball, and he did. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter attack. Hayes. It's with Ramirez. Johnny Hayes. McKenzie. Luis Suarez. Dangerous looking through ball. Pivotal moment defensively. Opportunity in the wide area. Showing patience, looking for the equaliser. 
It looked as though it had a chance of going in for the equaliser. It was close, it was a decent effort, just need to keep plugging away now and surely the goal will come. McCrory Ferguson Scott Brown Well the electronic board showing one additional minute Good looking sequence But nothing comes of it A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges it is half-time here. Well, no two ways about it. Luis Suarez in the first half absolutely taking the game by the scruff of the neck, Stuart. Well, Derek, he took his goal well and was a constant threat throughout that first half. I thought he showed a lot of skill to get out of tight situations and he had a real impact on the plate. Hello and welcome. Amid all the hustle and bustle of Marseille, we find this wonderful football theatre, the Orange Vélodrome. I'm Derek Ray, ready to bring you match commentary, and alongside me is Stuart Robson. And every expectation that this will be a captivating contest. It's France versus Germany. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. Now, do they mean business on this occasion? Magul. Well, that's how to break the spirit of the attacker. Delphine Cascarino. On to Henri. Leuports. 
patient build-up at the moment. Sven Yahoot. And just slightly offside. Karshawi. Gras Georo. Sakina Karshawi. And that was a very fine read. Delphine Cascarino. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Leupoltz. Schuler. Now here's Marojan. Lina Magul. Well, nicely cut out. Now what can they do with the ball? Getting forward. Perfect challenge. Griez and Buck. Majri. Dali. Now with Le Sommer. Amel Majri. She has options. Still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. Oh, excellent diving stop. And now the delivery, and a corner there that really lacked guile. Will it be? And a goal to give them the lead. They have their reward. Well, just watch this again. A change of pace, a change of direction, and a decent finish. That's a very good goal. And once again, Germany get the ball rolling. How will they react to this setback? Svenja Hut. And space for the cross. Very quick thinking there. Gras Georo. On to Lissomer. Dali. Alert defending. Debritz. Well, that is how to run at defenders. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. Not a huge chunk of added time, one minute. And there it is, the half-time whistle.
And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. My name is Derek Ray, and I'm joined for commentary by the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson. And if the game is as enticing on the pitch as it looks on paper, we're not going to be disappointed. This really should be a belter of a game, Stuart. Thanks, Derek, as always. This should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium. We've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? And still trying to get the shot off. Pulls it back. A fine use of the ball. Can he give them the lead? Well, I think you could call that an escape. It looked a certain goal. Stambouli. Here's Belhenda. Well, you never quite know who's going to emerge from the shadows and become a match winner, but this man might be a decent shout. What are you expecting to see from him, Stuart? Well, the best players are the ones that can play in tight areas, and he can certainly play in tight areas. He wriggles out of situations, he can find that penetrative pass, and he's such a good player when he gets the ball out of his feet and gets shots away. He could be the outstanding player today. Still on level terms, moving the ball nicely. A really top-notch piece of defending. Matias Vargas. Getting in there to intercept. Bradley. Josie Altidore. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. Asom Balonga giving the ball away. Bradley. Jonathan Osorio. And he read it well defensively. And a poor ball. And space to cross it. So a goal kick is what's coming up here. Asom Balonga, Balotelli. Now with Asom Balonga. Well, the attack looks promising, but they took care of the situation defensively. Richie Larea. Bradley. Marky Delgado. Lawrence. Bradley Richie Larea Osorio has it Posuelo shielding the ball superbly Bradley Marky Delgado mastery of the passing game getting forward Marky Delgado And a strong tackle. And with that, the first half draws to a close. Well, probably a fair assessment of his first half's work would be a mixed bag. Well, I've been disappointed with him in that first half. He just didn't have an impact on the game. Yes, the service into him wasn't great, but his movement needs to be a lot better. Let's hope he improves in the second. 